Around 2,000 years ago, King Hero of Syracuse had an almighty problem to solve. Having defeated his enemies in battle, the victorious king decided to show his gratitude by commissioning a gold crown worthy of the gods. The crown was delivered much to the delight of the king. However, rumours quickly began to circulate that the goldsmith had in fact tricked King Hero, replacing some of the gold with silver, equal in weight. The furious king wanted to know if his crown was made out of pure gold, but didn't know how to do it without melting it down and therefore destroying it. It was a real head-scratcher. Mm. In search of an answer to his problem, he turned to his cousin, Archimedes. At first, poor Archimedes was stumped. Oh. One day, deep in thought, he decided to take a bath. As he lowered himself into the water, he noticed the water around him rise. This got him thinking. Mm. Why not put a lump of gold into the bath, measure the amount that the water rises, and then place the crown into the water as well? Oh? If the water rises by the same amount, it will mean it's made of pure gold. Excited by his discovery, he jumped out of the bathtub yelling, Eureka! The Greek term for, I have found it. He had found a solution to Hero's problem. The story of Archimedes and the Golden Crown is a great example of how creative thinking can change how you approach a problem. You too may have experienced your own Eureka moment, where seemingly out of the blue you come up with a solution to a previously unsolvable work problem. During this course, we want to encourage you to think differently and find more creative solutions to problems. And we're going to achieve this in three simple steps. We're going to explore what creative problem solving is. We're going to cut out the fluff and explore the four key principles of CPS in detail. And we'll also provide you with a practical tool that you can use to increase your very own Eureka moments where you work.